Hi everyone! Last week I shared a video with you about how to put your emergency contact in your lock screen in case something were to happen to you and somebody needed to get in touch with your emergency contact. It's really important to have that information easily accessible. I'll share that video with you at the end of this one. You can easily click on it and see that tutorial. But today I want to talk to you about setting up an easy feature that iPhone has. And I apologize, I'm not sure if Android has this feature, but I'll show you how to do it in iPhone today. Um, using a simple app that comes with your phone. And when it's in the lock screen, if you slide it over and you click on that emergency button, they'll enable a feature that if you get sent to the hospital and you can't talk, that you can add in information that you want doctors to know. So if you're on certain medications or if you've had previous surgeries, of course you can put your emergency contact there as well. It's just a really great feature to help doctors and paramedics access information that they may not have on hand if you can't share that with them. So let me show you how to do it. So when you go into the emergency section of your screen, you can set up a little icon here that will give doctors and paramedics information that you would like to share with them. So I'm gonna show you how to go ahead and set that up. Apple comes with a really great app called Health right here, which I just recently discovered. What you do is you click on it, this screen is gonna come up. You're gonna click on medical ID, which is in the corner right here and you're gonna create your medical ID. And you can add in whatever information you would like to share with doctors. Here you can add your birth date, your medical condition. So let's say I'm gonna put um, brain tumor here, and then I'll put medical notes, had MRI May uh, 2015 at hospital. I would put the name of the hospital, let's say, there. Allergies, um, if you're allergic to penicillin, if you're allergic to latex, anything like that you're going to put in here. I'm going to put in none. Medications, you're going to list whatever medications you're on. So I'm going to say Tylenol, which I'm not on Tylenol, and you would not put that as a listed medication, but just to show you. Then you can add your emergency contact. You can go through your contacts there. I won't do it now because obviously I'm not going to put somebody's phone number for real. Um, you can add your blood type in here. To be honest with you, I don't even know what my blood type is. I'm just going to put this in for now. I'm going to go ahead and delete this after the video. Um, your weight and height, you can add that in. Any other notes you can put. So you're going to put done. Now you're going to make sure that show when locked is clicked on. So hit done. Now what's this going to look like? I'm going to go back in to the emergency screen. Now you see that little icon there. It says medical ID. I'm going to click on that and you have all of the things that I just listed. So this is really helpful to paramedics and doctors in case something were to happen to you, that information is easily accessible. So go ahead and do that. I love this, I love this app. Thanks for watching everybody. And if you haven't already seen that video on how to add your emergency contact to your locked screen, be sure to click on the video over here. It'll take you to that tutorial. I will also put a link in the description box below. And as always, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe to my channel to be notified when I post new videos. Thanks and have a great day. Bye.